Hi guys, I'm Woodcraft Hamster and I thought I'd do a quick video this morning just about making some breakfast. Um, it's not often I do a cooking video outdoors so I thought it was time to change that. Um, so I've got a little fire going here, it's just sort of uh, building down to some embers now. And what I want to do is get some bacon on. Um, so what I've done, I've cut a, uh, a green stick here. I've taken off the bark from one end, I've stuck a point on the other end, and all I'm going to do is just wedge that into the ground, um, directly over the top of the fire, so about here. So I'm now directly over the flames, um, and all I'm going to do is take my bacon, open it up, drape it over there, and the heat from the embers should start to cook that fairly quickly. So that's the bacon on guys, um, and what I want to do now is just basically get a brew going. Um, so you've seen my mug before, the titanium cup. Um, don't need to use the bale arm today. And all I'm going to do is fill that part way with some water. Like so. That's about half full, that's all I'm going to need for a decent cup of coffee. Um, and what I want to do is get the lid on that, just so it boils a little bit quicker. And if I come around the other side of the fire, away from where the bacon is going to drip on it basically. And just get that there, in and around the embers. We should be good to go. Now what I think I'll do guys, I'm going to leave that for another 5 or 10 minutes, see how things are getting on and we'll, uh, we'll come back when things have progressed. Right then guys, well the bacon's doing well, um, water's nearly boiled, so what I'm going to do is prepare my coffee and I think I've shown you this before, um, but I'm going to do it again anyway. Um, so what I've got is a little Swedish army um, cup, sort of a rubberized thing which just folds open like this, you get about half to three quarters of a normal cup of coffee in there which is just fine for me. Um, and again, in this little Ziploc bag, I've got um, some sugar, some coffee, and some powdered milk. So again, the whole lot just gets dumped into here. Hopefully you can see that in there a little bit. Um, and all I'm gonna do, I'm gonna find myself a nice small little green stick, just take off the bark, and that'll be my spoon. Um, and I'll come back uh, in probably a few minutes once the bacon's ready. Right then, guys, so we're pretty much done. Uh, my water has just come off a rolling boil which is absolutely lovely that's my coffee nicely brewing uh, I did have to sacrifice a piece of bacon to the fire um, it just slipped off before I had a chance to grab it um, so I'm down one piece but to be honest this all looks really nicely done nice and crispy um, I've had to move it away from the embers now because it was starting to burn a little bit. Um, but all in all, just finish making this. I'll just step over towards the camera. So again, we've got nice brew, some really nice bacon. It's probably taken about, I don't know, half an hour, 45 minutes in total to prepare the fire, get everything uh, gathered, get the fire lit build it up, get the embers, put the bacon on um, and the water obviously. 
Uh, but yeah, 45 minutes for a really nice breakfast. I'm certainly not going to complain, guys. Um, but I hope that was useful. Um, just a bit of an idea of what you can do when you come out into the woodlands. Um, you know, very minimal kit. You get yourself a bit of food, get a nice brew, um, and you get to practice a bit of bushcraft as well. Uh, but as always, guys, comments and questions in the box below. Um, like and subscribe if you'd like to see more, and I hope to see you all next time. Cheers, guys.